Jeff and Debbie Gifford share a lot as a couple. Both have hearing loss, both have a cochlear implant, and in late 2020, both received a second or bilateral cochlear implant at Sunnybrook just a few days apart. Surgeon Dr. Vincent Lynn says coverage for this procedure, encouraged by Sunnybrook advocacy and research, offers a new option for many adults. And when you hear on both sides, you, you get speech localization, so you know where the sound's coming from. Um, you're much better at hearing in noise. Like crowds, restaurants, and busy workplaces. Unlike a hearing aid, a cochlear implant is an implanted device that delivers impulses directly to the auditory nerve, which carries signals to the brain. The newest versions use sound processors that connect directly to mobile devices, meaning phone calls and music stream directly to the implant. You no gotta idea. let it go oh. for a while. Okay. Having already been through the process once, Jeff and Debbie know getting the best results takes time. And on the run. Oh. Uh, yes, good. The devices need to be adjusted and practice is key. Very good. You just try to expose yourself to sounds and environments that you were used to before. And the brain will kind of take that memory and try and slot it into into what, what you hear and try and put those two together. Both Jeff and Debbie say their bilateral implants and the chance to hear in stereo has changed their lives dramatically, despite all the work still ahead. I'm taking advantage of opportunities and I'm, in, I'm just generally enjoying life more. And you know, I'm retired and it just almost seems like I, I got a second chance at life. I've been so happy that comparing the first to the second um, I'm at a way, and Debbie is too, at a way more advanced level hearing-wise uh, at this stage of the game. Dr. Lynn says Sunnybrook is continuing to study bilateral cochlear implants and their impact on things like music perception. He says between 25 to 50 patients may benefit from this at Sunnybrook every year. With Sunnyview, I'm Monica Mattis.